Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Matt, here, and welcome to a brand new Matt Movie here on the Matt Movies channel. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys the newly revealed brickheads for Ghostbusters and Harry Potter, which are really cool, so here we go. So, starting off, we're going to be looking at the two Ghostbusters brickheads, and man, do they look flipping awesome. We have Peter Venkman, and we have Slimer. Slimer looks incredible. I love Slimer. He's got this cool green to him. I like the green that, that Lego chose. He's got an amazing, like, mouthpiece, and he comes along with a little hot dog accessory, and uh, it looks really nice. As you can see, he's floating. I'm assuming, obviously, they'll probably have, like, translucent Lego there. And Peter Venkman, he looks incredible. I think Lego did a fantastic job on him. I love the hair. I love the fact that they went with, like, a slimed version of him. And it just looks amazing. The fact that he has, like, slime on his forehead and on his, like, uniform, it looks amazing. You can see he's got the belt, the Venkman logo. The hair, again, looks amazing. And as you can see, his accessory is a proton blaster. And that looks amazing. It looks really great. It's obviously... Um, a bunch of like bricks put together to create a proton blaster and it looks amazing so really great brick heads so now we're gonna move on to the harry potter ones so starting off is hermione granger yes we are getting a hermione granger um brick head and it looks really nice as you can see here is the front of the packaging you can see hermione granger on the side with a little harry potter logo underneath and we we see her square in the center we get a really nice shot here of the back of the packaging with Hermione Granger. Uh, as you can see, it says, like, you can put her on her stand. And we get an advertisement to the Brickheads pack with Harry Potter, which we'll talk about in a second. Um, but, yeah, it looks really cool. Now, here we get a cool shot of Hermione herself, and she looks really great. As you can see, she's got her, like, gray uniform, as you can see. Her hair is long. It looks really nice. You can see she comes along with a wand. And she comes along with another accessory, which is a book, which is really cool. Because, you know, in the movies, Hermione is always, like, researching and studying about stuff. It's so awesome how they gave her a book to, I guess, basically represent that. And it looks really awesome. So, yeah, I think she looks great. Um, but, yeah, very cool brickhead indeed. So, the second brickhead is of Ron Weasley and Albus Dumbledore. So, these two are going to be coming along in a set together. As you can see, we've got them on the side again, kind of like Hermione, and they both look fantastic. We'll talk about their designs in a second, but yeah, um, they both look great. As you can see, um, yeah, we've got like the Brickhead logo, we've got them on the side, looking quite snazzy. Now here we get a cool shot of the back of the package, again, showing both of them and showing that they can be placed onto their stands with the little Harry Potter logo in the top right corner yeah right corner um but yeah it looks really great as you can see right here we have a really cool shot of both of them together um and they both look fantastic there's an individual shot of double door which we'll talk about in a second but ron looks really nice as you can see he's wearing like a black jacket he's got a wand he's got some really cool looking hair and he, as you can see he's got like a scarf which is like orange and dark red and it looks really awesome he's got a similar chest kind of like brick attire to um, Hermione, which would make sense considering, you know, they're both at the same school, so, yeah. But it looks really nice. I think they executed him very nicely, and um, he just looks really great. Um, he, I like the, um, um, yeah, he, just, he looks really cool. And as you can see right here, we've got a cool shot of Albus Dumbledore, and he looks freaking cool, man. I mean, he just looks amazing. I apologize for my language, but he just looks awesome. I love the cool... Uh, like patterns and everything on it with like the purple and the brown and the dark red at the top it looks amazing as you can see he's got a long white beard kind of reminds me of santa but claws a little bit <laughs> um but yeah he's got the long white hair long beard he's got some glass some like translucent pieces to kind of look like glasses and the amazing designs on his torso was just fantastic and as you can see he has a little wand looks really nice and now the final Brickhead pack, and that is of Harry Potter and Hedwig. Wait, am I saying that right? Hedwig? Yeah, Hedwig. Um, yeah, as you can see, we've got him and Hed we've got Harry and Hedwig on the side with the little Harry Potter logo underneath. And obviously, seeing as how it's Harry Potter, it makes sense to see uh, Harry as a Brickhead. And it looks really cool. We get a really cool shot of the back of the packaging here. Once again, displaying the fact that they can both be positioned onto their stands where you can then you know, like, display them, and, um, they both look really nice, 
as you can see, we've got a cool shot right here of both of them. You can see Hedwig on the right, and then there's Harry on the left. They both look really nice. I really like their designs. Well, we have individual photos, and we'll talk about them in a second. As you can see, we're going to start off with Harry. As you can see, Harry, he looks incredible. I, I really love the design. He's got a dark orange and dark red scarf, as you can see. It looks amazing. And I love the black costume. It just looks incredible. And the amazing, and I love the, I guess, a Gryffindor logo on his, um, on his chest. It looks amazing, and it's really awesome. As you can see, he comes along with, like, his glasses, obviously. And one of the pieces he even, ha even has the scar on it. It looks in incredible. But yeah, I really think they executed Harry very well. And finally, Hedwig. Hedwig is that bird, I believe. I forget which movie he was from, but he looks amazing. As you can see, he's got these cool, like, feather designs. Like, it's really cool how, like, the outline of his eyes are actually, like, yellow. And then the insides are, like, black and everything. It looks really cool. As you can see, he's got his mouth. And he's a lot smaller than the regular Brickheads. But it's still really nice to see that they've included Hedwig um, right here. Which looks very nice. So, there you guys have it. Those are the newly revealed Ghostbusters and Harry Potter Brickheads that will be coming later this year. Or, I, I don't know when they're coming. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then drop a like. And let me know what you think. Are you very excited for these? I personally think these sets look incredible. So, I'm hoping to maybe pick them up myself. If so, then you should expect to see maybe some showcases on the channel. Um, but yeah, so... Let me know what you think in the comment section below and uh, whether you're not excited to see these or get them. Sorry. But yeah, with that in mind, peace out and I'll see you later.